Hello out there, uh, Bruce Deary coming at you from Little Switzerland, North Carolina. First of all, thank you for watching my video. Um, <laughs> I just recorded this a few minutes ago and uh, the video came out but there was no sound. So uh, here I go again. Uh, incidentally, I, need, I know I need to get some new lighting because, you know, I got a shiny forehead and it looks like I'm, you know, I've got a hangover or, and I'm all flushed because I've been drinking all night, which is not the case. I haven't had a drink in 22 years. In any event, um, my topic today is on Sizzle International. Um, there has been uh, a lot of noise on the Internet about Sizzle International and its founder, Tom Maurer Sr., uh, in the last couple of months, um, have been approached by uh, any number of people that have been, been encouraging me to get involved and have been uh, touting the company as as the next great, in fact, the greatest MLM ever, or about to be the greatest MLM ever. Um, and uh, frankly, they've been bragging about the uh, uh, Sizzle's brand new 400,000 square foot manufacturing facility in in uh, in Utah, which is really supposed to be something, and also Tom Maurer's new 65,000 square foot home in Utah. But my question is that uh, that, I'm, that I'm posing is is Sizzle going to really sizzle or is it going to fizzle? Or another way of looking at it is is Sizzle. Uh, all sizzle and, and no steak, as the expression goes. Anyhow, uh, that's what I'm going to address. Uh, first of all, a little background of the company. The company was founded in, in 2006 by Tom Meyer Sr. and his two sons. Uh, they have been focusing until recently on uh, 11 uh, companies across the pond, so to speak, in, in Europe. And I suspect, I don't know for sure, the reason for that is that... Um, Prior to 2006, Tom Maurer sold his previous company, which was New Ways Manufacturing, which was a very successful company, uh, which he sold for $700 million, reportedly. And um, I suspect there was probably some type of a non-compete clause there where, uh, which disallowed him from selling competitive products for a few years in the United States. Again, I don't know, I don't know that for sure. Uh, anyhow, like I said, they have a brand new state-of-the-art manufacturing facility, um, and uh, it appears that they're recruiting people like crazy. Uh, product line. Uh, their product line is, is in the uh, health, nutrition, and, and wellness industry. Uh, their main focus seems to be on nutritional drinks, uh, weight loss products, and anti-aging products. Uh, their flagship products are a product called Eternity, which is a resveratrol based product and recently they've introduced a weight loss lollipop which is kind of an intriguing uh, thought. Um, competition. Competition in the, in the nutritional drink uh, market is is fierce. There are six or seven companies uh, they're basically all competing for the same dollar. Um, a lot of people have heard of Noni Juice which is the original one. You have Zango, you have Frutega, you have Free Life, you have Goji Juice, and, and or there are a few others that, again, are all competing for the same uh, consumer dollar. So um, the competition is really fierce, and, of course, each one of them says that their product is, uh, is better than the next, and I have no way of evaluating uh, which is better. And, and also, you should know that in the background, the FDA, the Food and Drug Administration, has been... Uh, trying to crack down on the on the nutrition drink market uh, because there are some pretty some pretty wild exaggerated claims about what these um, magical juices do for you, um, and the FDA is trying to take control of of, of the marketing of those of those products. Um, I'm going to take I'm going to ask you for permission to. Uh, uh, to look at my notes here. Actually, I'm not going to ask you. I'm going to take the liberty of looking at my notes because my memory is not what it used to be. Uh, cost to become a distributor is very reasonable. It's only $20. However, in the real world, uh, in order to make any money uh, with Sizzle, um, you're going to have to purchase a $350 starter package of their products and commit to purchasing $100 per month on an auto ship basis uh, of their products. 
Um, the compensation plan, um, the compensation plan is 12 pages long. It's filled with legalese, and to be honest, I didn't even attempt to read it, uh, you know, far less um, digest what it says. Um, the company states, and I have no reason to, to disagree with it because of the fact they manufacture their own products, there's a substantial profit margin which enables them to offer a very healthy compensation plan that's supposed to be um, very lucrative. I'm going to cheat again. Uh, competition, compensation, training and support. Um, there's very little indication on the website that there's that there's really any um, any type of training in the in, in in the back office, and it appears that they are mainly encouraging uh, their representatives to share the opportunity uh, with family, uh, friends, and relatives, and to invite people to home meetings and also home parties for one of their product lines, in particular. One of the areas that that disturbed me was their internet marketing policy. Uh, they have a very strict policy against online marketing and using social media marketing, um, which I don't understand, but uh, nevertheless, uh, they will allow you to create your own website. Uh, however, it has to be approved um, by the corporate office, and you're required to pay a $1,000 annual fee in order to continue to do that. And my reaction there was, ouch, that's pretty uh, a pretty costly thing. But, but the implication there, you know, to me, is that they're not allowing their representatives to market to the over 1.7 billion people on the Internet and use 21st century technology. Um, nevertheless, I was very intrigued with, with Sizzle's uh, story um, and was seriously considering it until a close friend of mine pointed out that there were some uh, legal skeletons in the closet, so to speak, uh, which gave me real pause, that in conjunction with the lack of the ability to do uh, online marketing. So here's what. Um, don't make a decision based upon this video. Uh, I encourage you to do your own uh, due diligence. Um, and I highly encourage you to uh, do a thorough Google search of... Uh, any legal uh, past or current history uh, about the company or the company ownership. And this doesn't just apply to, to Sizzle. Um, you know, any company you're, you're looking at, I would encourage you to do that. So I hope that's shed some light on Sizzle International, and uh, hopefully you will find the opportunity you're looking for, and I wish you much success and have a great day. Bye for now.